My name is Jawan Pringle. I'm 22. And I'm a corporal in the United States Marine Corps. My name is First Sergeant David Pelly. I'm a United States Marine. I'm 52 years old. I joined because I wanted to be the best of the best. I joined the military because I realized that uh, to get the things that I wanted in my life, I needed to have a plan. And when I graduated from high school, the only plan that I had fell through. And I just wanted to make a, a, a better man of myself. I knew I wanted college money and I knew I wanted to join uh, a branch of the military where I would feel respected and where um, I would get the most enjoyment, and so I joined the Marine Corps because we do have the best uniforms. There's nobody like us. I was 19. I'd always been in the same place. I'd never been away from home. Um, it's not so much physical. It's more mental. Being away from my family was tough. Those three months, 13 weeks, it's probably one of the toughest things. No phone, uh, no social media, no nothing. Like you're taken out of what you're used to, and you're, you're brought to something totally different. A whole new experience that breaks you down and builds you back up. Absolutely. I think that military people are probably better treated today than we've ever been treated before. Yes. Of course. <laughs> I really didn't plan to teach in JROTC, but I met someone uh, here in South Carolina while I was down here for a job fair, and they talked to me about NJROTC, and I knew that I liked to uh, work with students and high schoolers, and so I decided to give it a try. And it was really tough my first year. I said I wasn't going to do two years of it, and this is my 11th year. So I think that some of the benefits are when you see students walk across the stage and graduate mm -hmm. from high school and then go out into the, the workforce. And whether they're going into the military or not, it's still great to see people succeed. It means um, being, being able to say, I'm a United States Marine is uh, it's a great feeling. Being in the military means one thing. It means that I am willing to put my life on the line for you and for your freedoms. The fact that I uh, protect and serve the country, this country that I love, is, uh, is an amazing feeling. I can't, I can't really express it. People talk about people taking a knee during the national anthem, people talk about people burning the flag, things of that nature. All of those people have a right to do that because I have fought for those freedoms that they have. So basically, People who are in the military are writing a blank check to the United States public saying, this is me, this is my life. I am willing to give up in, up into my life in order for you to have freedom. And I think that's very important for us in a democratic society.